Chief Rick Byron is providing all the traffic control for today's parade. We sincerely appreciate their assistance. And the patrol car from the Pickle Post of the Ohio State Highway Patrol is joining them. And the car there is being driven by Trooper Eric Gavels. They sure do. You can barely hear us. I know. And it looks like they get the louder they get. But they always start to pray. We have wonderful, I mean, that is a tradition. A long tradition here in Pickle. And I do see a banner. And that's the same part of the place. Good night. Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! 
Kansas from Piquis Central Kiwanis Kids. Good job, and you look good too. Merry Christmas. And coming up after them is the Kiwanis Builders Club. It's a service organization and the junior high version of Kiwanis. The goal is to build leaders and to serve others locally, statewide, nationally, and globally. All students at Pickwood Junior High School are welcome to participate. Builders Club has monthly meetings that keep students informed through school announcements. I think I see Dylan Weatherly. Well, hello there, Dylan. Hi, Mark. Thanks for all you do. I see Park National Bank. I see Park National Bank. That's Park National Bank. I know that they've been part of the community for a long, long time. And, uh, and they are good community leaders and we appreciate them being in the Pippa Downtown Parade. Happy birthday, Polly! There's a birthday wish for Paul. They're just gonna keep on coming, Paul. I see the Girl Scouts of Pickle and Covington. The Pickle Covington Service Unit of the Buckeye Trails Girl Scout Program is building girls of courage, confidence, and character who make the world a better place. These girls come from Pippa, Covington, and River Grove. The girls range from kindergarten to seniors in high school. Looking good. It's okay. First, first time to do a parade? <laughs> Merry Christmas, everyone. What do we have next? Coming up is the Pickle Community Foundation. It encourages charitable giving to benefit the citizens of Piqua and provides a variety of methods for donors to help fulfill their charitable giving wishes. The foundation accepts donations, both large and small, and awards grants and scholarships to enhance the Piqua community. The foundation offers permanent management of funds to help donors extend their charitable giving beyond their own lifetime. The Pickle Community Foundation. When you share with us, we share with many. Is that reindeer Rebecca Sussex? Is that Robin? Is that you? Merry Christmas! Thank you. Look at that beautiful old car. Oh, oh. It's so running, that gives me hope. <laughs> All right, who's in that car? Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas to all of you. And then we have Pippa Catholic following. I love the old car. This is, this is, is that a fire truck? Is that a pickup? Does it, you pick up girls? Oh, it might work, it might work. Pickford Catholic School is committed to educating the whole child, mind, body, and soul. If you're looking for a school that upholds Christian values, Pickford Catholic School is here for you. And Principal Zimmerman is in the uh, parade there. Thanks for all you guys do. Merry Christmas, everyone. I love the golf cart. Beep, beep, beep. Merry Christmas, everybody. Oh, aren't you sweet?
I'm, I'm in the prime location for that. And look what she gave us, the airhead. <laughs> Most appropriate. <laughs> Who do we have next, baby? Play, learn, and grow daycare. They got a little wagon they're pulling. I bet there's a tweaker in that wagon. What is that? They opened in 2019, and they offer quality, play-based early childhood education programs serving infants through preschool children. They earned a five-star rating through Step Up Quality this fall. For more information, give them a call. Play, Learn, Grow Child at 916-2016. You can also Google that or call Main Street Pick One. She'll give you the phone number. There you go. Many ways to get in touch. Pack 76 has some amazing things planned this year, and they should, they would love to have you stop by. And I'll tell you, never is a time more important for get kids involved. Thank you. In scout in scouting program in church, it's, it's a good base for the kids. And thank you to the volunteers that help. You you scout leaders are so important, and we thank you. And coming up next is the Jenkins family. This is a 1957 Chevrolet Fire Chief car. The Jenkins family wants to wish everyone a happy holiday. Thank you, Jenkins, for bringing the, the vehicle out today. You know, I think they've been in every parade forever and ever. They're always here supporting the community uh, by being part of the parade. Merry Christmas. Beautiful. Oh. Well, we've got a little leg here before the next group comes up. Uh, maybe we could talk about some of the stores downtown, places to go and do some shopping. Right. What and your, What are your places you like to go? Well, I like all of them, but I definitely like food, so you can find me in Susie's Big Dipper no matter how cold it is. You can always taste good ice cream from them. Well, I just had a bowl of chili that from there, and it was amazing. But you know, I stopped down at Readmore Hallmark, and they've got a lot of nice gift items. They do. In Barclays, the Apple Tree Gallery. Yep. And the Elite Shop. Have you been there? Yeah. They have great pickle ornaments. They have unique things. If you're looking for some, a gift for somebody that's maybe a little hard to buy for, but that might be the place to stop. And that's down uh, on the corner of Green and Main Street, right across from the Moore Harmont. And you know who's beautifully decorated is the Pickle Library. Uh -huh. Awesome. Oh, oh my goodness. Did you go upstairs and see the trees up there? I did. The trees and then downstairs in the children's area. It's all decorated and doing crafts and what have you. Wow. Yeah, beautiful. 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 So. Coming up now is the uh, Piqua. Well, whoops, awesome Piqua group. And their goal is to make Piqua more awesome by surprising and delighting our citizens. I didn't know it could be any more awesome since we have Lorna Swisher here. Yeah, this is true. Okay. But anyway, the awesome Piqua group, do you have an idea to surprise and delight our community? This foundation will give you a thousand dollar grant to help you make that happen. Awesome Piqua encourages you to visit their website 
at awesomepickwa.com and submit your idea. There's another birthday wish for me. This is for Paul. Happy birthday, Paul. Thank you, Awesome. And Dan French, hi, thanks for making this happen. The Awesome French family. We're passing out some candy here. That's nice. Look at the puppy dog. Oh my goodness. He's got little tiny short legs to make this walk. <laughs> oh wow, she's going to give us some dum dums. I wonder why. <laughs> Is there a head hidden me yeah. in there? First airheads and now dum dums. What's I that know. say about it? I know. Yeah, yeah we need two dum dums up here. <laughs> Thank you. All right, who's next on this in this parade? Oh my! Bright Review Pippa provides immediate access to treatment for alcohol and addiction, as well as access to counselors and case management on an outpatient level. Bright View of Piqua is located at 1830 West High Street in Piqua. You can call them for more information. And the phone number is 937-5. Nine three seven five seven zero two five four six. Uh, Paul, you need to turn the camera on Peggy when she's dancing around here on this stage, trying to get away from the feedback. <laughs> oh, look at you! Bryce Realty would like to wish everybody a season of sweetness, showcasing their Candyland home, located in Sydney and servicing 22 Ohio counties. Merry Christmas from everyone at Bryce Realty. Did you see the dog? He's so cute. Adorable. He's decorated beautifully. Thank, Thank you. you. This is Parents as Teachers. Parents as Teachers is a free volunteering program open to any family in the Pickle area who have children birthed through kindergarten. It is the goal of our parents as teachers to help parents give their children the very best possible start in life. Parents as Teachers is a, a United Way agency and they've been around a long time and they do amazing, amazing work. So if you have a little one, call Parents as Teachers to get them involved in that. It's a good to start for them. And following them is Garden Ridge. It specializes in assisted living, memory care, and independent living with current apartment availability. So if you know anybody that is interested, give them the name Garbury Ridge. Oh, the next group is a big group, great big group. Scouts, BSA Troop, Boy Scouts of America Troop 295 and Cub Scout Pack 295. The Cub Scouts and Troop are affiliated with Westminster Presbyterian Church in Piqua. They are active in our community with service projects like the Scouting for Food campaign and placing the flags on our veterans' graves at Fuller Street Cemetery every Memorial Day. What a nice thing to do. If you have a child between the ages of 5 and 17, who could be interested in joining this, this exciting organization? Please reach out today, and that's at Westminster Church. Cub Scouts and Boy Scouts and the Pickle Youth Wrestling. Following them is the future of our high school program. Helping the most boys and girls into discipline, fierce competitors for any sport. If you are interested in being a part of the new program, please reach out to them and get signed up. Hi, oh, kids. What a big group. Thanks for coming out Merry today. Christmas. You guys look awesome. Here we go. Oh, this is the Parker family. Parker's Mobility. Artie Parker, the owner of Parker's Mobility, is joining the parade in a unique vehicle. He's got a motorized couch. Now, you know, I think this is what we need in our house. And I won't expound on that, why we need a motorized couch, but it would be so useful. Thanks, Mark, Artie. Merry Christmas. And coming up is the city of Piqua. 
A quality life is peace of mind that you live in a safe place. It is security knowing locally owned companies have stood by community for decades. It is confidence that efforts to revitalize the heart of the city transformed this stunning building back into an icon and where new plans will reconnect downtown with the riverfront in dynamic fashion. It is a partnership of citizens joined in the idea that here in Ohio, there can be a city that looks to its past with pride, looks to its future with optimism, and welcomes all the open arms. The City of Piqua employees strive to make our city a place to remember and a place you can rediscover. We would like to also give a shout out to our elected officials, Mayor Chris Lee and City Commissioners Casey Hines, Tom Bowes, Cindy Pearson, and Chris Grissom. Thanks to them for all the long hours that they put in to helping make our city better. Now, if you in your life don't know whether you're coming or going, maybe the Upper Valley JVS is just where you need to be. It is now called the Upper Valley Career Center. And this unique vehicle, you don't know whether you're coming or going in. Who's driving? Who's on first? You guys are amazing. Thank you for coming. The Mid-Ohio Keepers Organization is a non-profit keep club. We have over 2,000 members across the state of Ohio. They host many charity rides, as well as other club trail and road rides. Listen to that great music they brought along. Making me want to dance. We do appreciate the special role they have played in the holiday parade today. They all decorated up, looks so beautiful, and had lots of uh, music with them. Candyman. Nice jeans. Those are really well decorated. All the candy decorations on them. That's so fitting for the, the theme of the parade is Candyland, is it not? Candy it is. Look, it all makes so much sense. Now I know why they're giving us candy. Hello? Wait, we start this parade over. Now we know what we're doing. We finally have figured out the theme. Wow, wow. All right, who's coming next? You got a little stroller. I don't know whether that's a little kid in that stroller or that's a puppy dog. These days, you don't know. What does that banner say? Can you read, the, can you read backwards? <laughs> it says Sunrise Treatment Center.net. <laughs> oh my. You're energetic, aren't you? Yes, there you go. Merry Christmas. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, and there's a puppy dog in the stroller. <laughs> oh, look, Hammond. School buses. Do you remember when the bus come and pick you up in the morning? You barely had your eyes open. <laughs> Another day of school. Here we go. <laughs> I was always the first one to get off the bus. Last one to get off of the bus. Pickle City Schools Transportation Department transports 2,800 kids to and from 14 school buildings in and out of the district. We strive to serve your kids in a safe and timely manner while they are in our care. We, let's say it this way, we are Piqua! <laughs> Merry Christmas from the Piqua City Schools! We are Piqua! We beat Troy this year! <laughs> Good job.
job. Who we have next, Peggy? Here comes the Polar Express and Santa's helpers from the family of Hartzell Companies. Hartzell Air Movement and Hartzell Hardwoods are family-owned businesses here in Dikwa. These companies have been around for over 140 years. Melinda, well, you're older. Do you remember that? I, I just barely remember them starting. Yeah. Okay. Well, the legacy of innovation and inspiration has traveled through six generations of the Hartzell family and is still alive and well in Tikla. Please join us in welcoming the Hartzell Polar Express. Oh, and speaking of Polar Express, don't you love that movie? That is the best. Oh, I gotta find that on TV tonight with a cup of hot chocolate and Polar Express. That's where it's at. Hi! You've got the best seats in the house. You do. Operation Veteran Caregiver or Support. Operation Veteran and Caregiver or Support. Assisting Veterans their caregivers and families by connecting them to the resources they've earned. We work with the whole veteran family and look forward to assisting you in your time of need. For more information can be found on Facebook. Look for Operation Veteran Caregiver Support. What a great organization to reach out. Reach out to people. There are a lot of people that are in need and need help and need to know that they're loved and cared for. So don't be shy. Let somebody know that you care. Following them is the Miami County Animal Shelter. They are dedicated to protecting the health, safety, and welfare of the citizens of Miami County, enforcing the Ohio Revised Code, leash license, and dog cruelty laws in Miami County, and to find permanent caring homes for adoptable homeless pets. They've gone to the dogs today. Oh my, the Miami County Animal Shelter. Thank you, thank you for all you do. Isn't there a song called Who Let the Dogs Out? Who Let the Dogs Out? Woo, woo, woo. Oh, you are trying to see it together? Oh, yeah. oh, come on. She is such a chicken. Just read the next one. All right. Classic kiss. 98. Happy birthday, Pa. Another... 98.1 WPTW is Miami County's classic hip station serving the Upper Miami Valley since 1947. WPTW offers local sports and news. Be sure to listen to Clint in the morning. He has all the latest happenings in Pippa and beyond. They have the classic hits you love from the 70s, 80s, and 90s. And if you're a company wanting to advertise, give Chuck Black a call at WPTW. He'll take care of all your advertising needs. There you go. There you go. <laughs> and following them is the Skinner Powder Coating. It's been in operation since 2009, owned by David and Jill Middleton, lifelong residents of Pitchla. Jeremy Wilson is the company's lead foreman at the company, skilled in many trades. Skinner Powder Coating caters to many individual customers as well as many local fabricators. They want to wish the residents of Piqua a very Merry Christmas. Stop, stop for all your automotive needs. Thank you for your continued support this year. We have the privilege of supporting the local community teams and events throughout the year. I love basketball. And Huff Trucking is your hometown trucking company providing services for local businesses like Hartzell, Hobart, Miami Valley Steel, Scott Steel, Coil Plus, Jackson Teeth, and many more since 2003. Whoa! Look at this great group of trucks!
Wow. Huh? Fucking have Thank you for participating. Aren't they beautiful? Wow. I don't even like to watch my car. I know I wouldn't like to watch a truck. I'd take a big car wars, wouldn't it? I think they had special car wars to do that. Okay. I believe it. And right behind them is the Salvation Army. They have been serving Miami County for more than a century, meeting basic human needs. Today we serve through our Christmas joy shop with toys and food for the holidays. This summer feeding program and hygiene pantry is available. They do so much you work. You volunteer with us. I do, yes. Yeah. I sat on the board for a while. It's such a great organization. So when you see them out at the, with their, uh, their red uh, kettle, kettle and ringing the bell, please, please be generous and give because they do so much good work. What 
they can do. Yeah. Come on. Come on.
Be sure to stop by the Sounds of the Season concert at St. James Church. The concert starts at 5 p.m. tonight and is hosted by the Pickle Arts Council. The Valley Church of Pickle is handing out free hot chocolate at the gazebo right now. If you head down there, they'll be happy to serve you. Merry and Christmas! I, I just, I want to, just real quick. Thanks to Lorna Swisher, our Main Street director. She puts on all the events that are downtown. She does an incredible job. And uh, we just want to thank her for her countless hours. Um, she's just amazing. And we hope she sticks around in Pickwell for a long, long time. And she makes this all possible. So thank you, Lorna. And Merry Christmas, Piqua. Merry Christmas to everyone. We had a great time. Thank Happy you, Paul. Be safe, love one another. Birthday and boy, Paul. Thank you for taking the time to, to video this. And we want to say happy birthday to Paul. Right? Happy right. birthday, Paul.